Hey everybody, it's me again, coming at you with a new edition of Rainbow Me Approved Children's Books. And today, we are going to celebrate the life and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Now, of course, most of you know that Martin Luther King Jr. was the father of the Civil Rights Movement, a powerful, emotional period of time in U.S. history where people of color fought for equal rights. And Martin Luther King was the leader, the innovator of the Civil Rights Movement. And so we want to celebrate the day by introducing you to three books that look at his life and legacy from three very different perspectives. The first is from the perspective of his own son, Martin Luther King III. The title of this book is My Daddy, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. What was it like growing up as a son of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.? This picture book memoir, My Daddy, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. by Martin Luther King III provides insight into one of history's most fascinating families and into a special bond between father and son. So the top review says, this book opened my eyes to the man that was a father and a husband, but also a strong figure in the world. This book made me think about the sacrifices made by this family so that we could have a level of freedom that we had never experienced before. We hear a lot about Dr. King, but nothing about the children who donated a father to the civil rights movement. In the eyes of this eight-year-old, I see a Southern gentleman who loved to play with his kids, who took family time and family values seriously. I also hear the heart of a 10-year-old who will forever see images and pictures and insights into the father he can no longer touch. Kudos and much love to you, Martin King III. Your life is a legacy of a king. Wow. Can you imagine losing someone, like losing a father, number one, but then losing a father so publicly? And as a part of history, this image of his is played over and over again. So this just brings it into the eyes of a child, his own child. So fascinating, fascinating perspective. Next we have Meet Martin Luther King Jr. by Johnny Ray Moore. This title is suitable for ages four to eight years old and beginning with King's childhood and following his life through his I Have a Dream speech and subsequent death this book reveals in age-appropriate language how kink ended segregation in America and influenced the way we live our lives today. So how difficult is it to explain to a four-year-old why we celebrate Dr. Martin Luther King's birthday, why we celebrate his legacy, and why what he did was so important? This book helps to do that. And rounding off our list, last but certainly not least, we have A Sweet Smell of Roses by Angela Johnson. This book says there's a sweet, sweet smell in the air as two young girls sneak out of their house down the street and across town to where men and women are gathered, ready to march for freedom and justice, inspired by countless children and young adults who took a stand. Two Coretta Scott King honorees offer a heart lifting glimpse of children's roles in the civil rights movement. And the top review for this book says, this picture book is about two girls who sneak out of the house one day to join a freedom march with Martin Luther King Jr. during the civil rights movement. The text is written in free verse and the illustrations follow and enhance the story. The illustrations are done in charcoal with a hint of red in most of the pictures. A ribbon on the teddy bear, the American flag, roses all signifying the freedom that the people were marching for. So how cool is it to be able to see the perspective from, first we started with the perspective of Dr. Martin Luther King from his own children, and now we see the perspective of um, the civil rights movement from, from children who were a part of it and what they had to do, how they participated. So awesome book for you guys. Hope you guys appreciate our Rainbow Me Approved books, and we will see you very, very soon. Thanks. Bye.